Hello guys and welcome back to a new video. So as I promised you in, in the other video, um, today I will talk about the new multimedia system from uh, Peugeot 208, also the new 3D cockpit. Uh, I will review it and I try to go into detail to show you every single information about uh, this new 3D cockpit. It's quite, quite interesting to see that uh, Peugeot come with this great, great uh, new generation of digital cockpit, three dimensional. And I don't know if you see it so well on the camera, but I have to tell you in real, this look phenomenal. Um, the display look fantastic. You can also customize the way you want it. You can see the navigation right there in the front. Uh, you can see all kinds of information about the speed. Um, you can see the in the right side how much uh, gas you still have it in the left side also the temperature and how many kilometers you can still drive it uh, right here you can see uh, the consumption of the car I'm not sure if you will you are able to see really on the video in 3d but when you are here uh, with the car you will understand when you are live inside the car and you look at the cockpit you will really understand uh, how cool uh, all that things are and how nice it looks like uh, i can really explain you in words uh, what you see in real also the new multimedia system uh, right here on the right we will go in a moment uh, it has almost the same color you can uh, you can see it has a very good resolution and the contrast of the colors are great uh even the the software behind it and the hardware it's very good because you can see it's very responsive and and everything uh respond very well to 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 the touch and to the comments even the multimedia system the same as the cockpit now here you can see you have different option to customize the the cockpit the digital cockpit so um you have a few few um option there that you can choose from uh, also here you can change the different mode of driving you can go in normal mode eco mode or sport mode so you have free option uh, of driving uh, while you drive the car so uh, they are pretty pretty uh, simple to change and you can feel the difference while you're driving if you didn't see it yet my other video with the drive test the new Peugeot 208 uh, I recommend it to check out uh, on my channel uh, and you will see it. Also from the steering wheel, you can also uh, control um, the things right there on the cockpit so you can change it very simple uh, the way you want to see it uh, right there on the front. Um, I like the way it looks with navigation. You have all the information right there in front so you don't need to uh, you don't even need to look on the navigation side right here. Also, the navigation have um, you can use it as a touch screen, but you can also use the buttons down here. Uh, the shortcut buttons are right here in the middle. Uh, so you can see you can go to radio. Right here you have the multimedia and the radio and uh, all that option, USB, and you can connect the car. Uh, very easy if you have a stick, USB stick or your phone. Here we have the climatic system that you can control it. Uh, it's very simple. You can change the temperature, the vents. And um, I like the, the fact that you can control it right now from the screen. Now we have the navigation. It's much more improved from the previous model. I'm really impressed to see that Peugeot come with a great hardware behind it and also the software it's awesome because you can see how responsive is the screen and how responsive uh, it is also those uh, this soft uh, you can also uh, see it in 3d or in 2d uh, you can uh, choose different um, different point where you you want to navigate and also um, it's very simple to use. You have all the information right there on the right side. And right here you can choose, for example, a city. And you can see how fast it will load. So let's put, for example, Paris. And let's see 
right now the navigation it's loading so we find one uh one city i guess it says it's not the right one but yeah it doesn't matter we just uh click to navigate and now the the um, software it's loading and let's see how much time we need to load uh to the destination but anyway i have to tell you that the the view from the driver point of view it's awesome you have a great visibility it's towards the driver side and also the the cockpit there it's awesome you have a great great visibility i love the way they design the dashboard and everything uh, i have to say this new peugeot 208 it's uh my favorite car in this class uh from far away my favorite car uh, best price technology and uh, design interior design and also the quality of the material it's awesome anyway here you go to the car guys and you see all that information uh, about the car so you can change the start stop system for example and um, the parking sensors uh, and all that option about the car uh, right here you have the security settings on the car active uh, safety brake because this car uh, come with an option that you can add this radar for adaptive cruise control and it has emergency brake and all that new um, safety feature uh, for example the lane assist and all that stuff here is the light so you can adjust even the light uh, and then the park uh, parking uh, safety system also then we go to application you can connect your car to the apple carplay android auto mirror link or uh yeah connect uh, your app you can connect the car to the wireless as well um so yeah the car have a uh, internet connectivity uh, so that's like the all new is this car here we have some information about the screens so you can adjust the screens you, if you don't like this red color red um, tem you can change the tem for example right now it's in blue so you can see even the cockpit uh, is changing in blue uh, the different uh, function there so it's it's quite cool to be able to change even this uh, option so right now the navigation it's load i like the screen uh it's a glossy screen and it's very well positioned right there uh, in the front it's collaborate together but i think if you have this new uh, digital cockpit 3d you don't even need to look in the navigation right here on the right side but it's good uh to have it right there so um i have to tell you this is the best the best navigation uh system the best multimedia system the, the best cockpit that i see in a small class until now and it's by far by far the the most beautiful and the most nice um futuristic um new age design that i see in a car um in 2019 so i have to tell you guys the new peugeot 208 it's fantastic i totally recommend it and it's my favorite car in this class uh anyway I hope you enjoyed the short review. Please subscribe to my channel, guys. Um, check out my other videos. Also, I have the test drive and the full review with the new Peugeot 208. Check out my other videos. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. I hope it was helpful. And see you soon in the next video. Bye, guys.